Hello friends, uh, next module medical jurisprudence. Well, this is one of the quite difficult topic, uh, difficult topic of the entire forensic medicine area. This is the difficult topic. Uh. So, first mo A module is legal procedures, uh, B module would be medical law and ethics. So, A module is legal procedures. So, this is uh, the statue of uh, justice in the Madre bench of uh, Madras High Court. So, now take this case for example. Uh, O.J. Simpson case, O.J. Simpson, yes, you might have heard of his name, O.J. Simpson and the trial was known as uh, trial of the century where O.J. Simpson and this is his wife with child. So, O.J. Simpson was accused of uh, killing his wife and her boyfriend and this was supposed to be the scene of crime. And uh, the, the scene we have con they have confiscated a glove, uh, a blood stained glove, whereas the blood stained matched the victims, whereas the glove contained DNA that matched OJ Simpson. That matched OJ Simpson. So, what else we need other than DNA evidence? The DNA is a foolproof evidence, the DNA is a foolproof form of identity. Even in this case, O.J. Simpson was acquitted, it means released, released on all charges, released on all charges, yes. So now, even with a DNA evidence, now O.J. Simpson was acquitted of all charges in this criminal case, yes. So now, what is this? So tears and triumph, yes, tears and triumph, it means win at last. So, jury awards Simpson punitive damage, that is Simpson has to pay compensation, compensation. So, this is way back in, way back in, yes, can we see. So, this happens in 1995 and this happens in 2010, same case, same case same case, same piece of evidences, different judgment. How come this is possible? Yes, how come this is possible? Yes, we will say about it. To understand that, to understand that we enter into the concept of legal procedures. Yes. So, this is a maxim saying ignorantia juris, that is absence of knowledge, ignorant about law. Ignorance about law is not an excuse not an excuse, huh? not an excuse. So, ignorance in law is not an excuse. So, this entire chapter is based on, an entire chapter, huh? the entire legal procedures is based on this flow chart. So, first thing, the case. So, when a doctor is subject to a medical legal case, one is, if he examines a medical legal case, if he examines a medical legal case and sends opinion, and sends opinion, uh, right? If we are in casualty, we are receiving uh, emergency cases, MLC cases, snake bait cases, electrocution cases, assault cases, RT cases. So, in casualty, we receive, we examine, we treat. Uh, that is the first type. Second type is opinion sought. Opinion sought. Say, for example, if you are uh, an orthopedician and a person comes to you for the want of. Uh, your expert orthopedic opinion for a negligence case he is about to file against another doctor or A and B or husband and wife, B goes for applying divorce stating that his wife A is suffering from mental unsoundness. Now, wife comes to you and you are a practicing psychiatrist. Now, wife comes to you and says, please appear for me and certify me as mentally sane. So, now you are going as a private party, yes, private party. So, these two cases are examined, yes, let it be. Now, we have to know one thing, one is the prosecution, next is the defense. So, when you call a prosecution, yes, so to understand this, we have two kind of systems, one is criminal justice, next is civil justice. See, civil justice is a dispute between two parties. 